I'm doing a, my name is Claudia and I'm, and my name is Claudia and I'm doing a, um, a speech about child abuse. Child abuse and neglect is a huge problem confronting our society today. There are ways to prevent child abuse. There are factors causing it. But right now, many children are suffering from it. There are four main types of abuse, sexual, physical, emotional, and neglect. Did you know that 227,080 children are sexually abused each year? 811,000 are physically abused each year. 60,500 children die of child abuse each and every year. That's five children each day. Did you know that 80% of those children that die are under the age of four? And there is a report of child abuse every 10 seconds. This abuse follows them all throughout their life. That has been proven as well. Out of prison inmates, 80% of them were abused as a child. There are many causes of child abuse. One cause is that the person causing the abuse might have been abused as a child as well. Another is that they might be having problems with their partner or spouse and they are taking it out on the child. And the last possible cause is financial issues. Can you believe that? Financial issues. You might be thinking, wow, there are other ways to deal with that. In my opinion, the child is not the one at fault here. Victims of child abuse often grow up convinced that they can't do anything right and they're not worth anything. Others build up the anger and are likely to explode at some point, continuing the cycle of abuse with their children. If the abusive behavior is corrected or treated quickly, they may not be as affected or are able to see that they are worth something and they are capable of being loved as all children should be. It shouldn't hurt to be a child. Oh, um, there are ways to prevent child abuse. For example, call social services. They will take action from there. They might possibly suggest that another family member can take custody of the child or they can take the child from the home. However, with so many cases being called in, they aren't always correct in saying that a child is safe in their own home. If the child is in immediate danger, then call 911. If social services won't act, the police will. You may be thinking that if a close friend or family member is abusing a child, you don't want to report it out of fear of losing your friend, or you don't want your friend to be put in jail. But think about it. If the abuse continues, there's a good chance that the child will suffer from emotional problems or in the worst case, die. In that case, the police would get involved and the parents would be caught on a murder charge, which is a worse sentence than child abuse. Also, think of the welfare of the child. How would you sleep at night knowing that an innocent child could be suffering at the hands of people who are supposed to be their protectors. Take a chance and save a life. And I have a quote by Pablo Casals. It says, a child must know that he is a miracle, that since the beginning of the world, there hasn't been an until the end of the world, there will not be another child like him. <laughs>